Bring an unbelievable from Derby. 3-3 three, three the end result. You must be gutted without doubt the better team, but somehow you didn't win. Look, you know, it was a very difficult game. A very difficult game. You know, Rangers are, are so good defensively. You know, they we couldn't break them down. You know, it took us at least, you know, you know, ten seconds to score the goal there. And, you know, Mader scored the goal, but it was James Tavernier that made it the chance. So um, and then, you know, for Rangers to, to be 2 0 down and, you know, come back to 2 2 and hold on to that you draw um, for at least, you know, a two seconds shows what a great team they are. And, um, you know, when Ida scored, Ida thought, you know, we'd have won the game from there. But unfortunately, you know, it didn't happen. But I'm very proud to be here. And did any Rangers players stand out for you with their performance today, Brendan? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I think the player who really, you know, stood out for me. For Rangers was Fabio Silver. What a talent, you know, what an actor, you know, he's unbelievable. His ability, you know, he done more rollovers than the National Lottery and uh, he's that good of an actor. You know, he managed to convince a referee um, to book him for diving um, and then give a penalty at the same time. You know, that's a, that's a, what a wonderful actor he is. And I think he is the Portuguese Martin Compton, you know, and if he carries on like that, you know, he could actually be in the next series of Rabsy Ness, but I think I think he's a wonderful actor and he'll win an Oscar. He should have won one today. Superb. I'm very proud to be here. Uh, it was a controversial game. Did you think VAR made the right call with a Rangers penalty? You look, you know, I don't think you can argue with a penalty. You know, I think that, you know, young, you know, Fabio Silver has been brought down by the wind there. And I think the wind should have been sent off. You know, he was the last, you know, man or gust of natural forces of the universe so you know I think that you know John Beaton I don't want to talk about John Beaton boyhood Rangers fan who's helped Rangers not get beaten today um, but I also want to give a you know an honourable mention to the guys at VAR who did a great job today uh, Ali McCoist, uh, Philip Albert, Basil Bowley, um, Gordon Ramsay and um, Gordon Ramsay's quiff so you know I think they did a great job fair play to them very proud to be here. And finally, Brendan, I know you don't want to point fingers, but who would you blame for this 3-3 defeat? Look, you know, I don't think it's, you know, fair for me to point fingers here, but it is 157% the board's fault. You know, Rangers are going and signing, you know, Portuguese international wingers, and all I've been given is two cans of Iron Brew, uh, Rod Stewart's greatest hit CD, and... Um, you know, of course, a Braveheart DVD. And I don't think that's much for me to use in the transfer market. So I'll blame them. Uh, but look, you know, there's another 37 old firms to go. So I'm very proud. And, um, you know, we need to focus on our next game, you know, against Montrose under 12. So I'm very proud to be here.